Brett, thanks for being with us. Uh, we understand the AFN is looking into harassment allegations against Ontario Regional Chief Roseanne Archibald. Uh, what are those allegations? Mm -hmm. Yeah, Dennis, we learned earlier today that the Assembly of First Nation is going to proceed with what it calls a full investigation into harassment claims that several members of AFN staff have leveled against uh, Ontario Regional Chief Roseanne Archibald. Um, she put out a statement last night saying she became aware of those allegations on February 5th when National Chief Perry Bellegarde contacted her along with uh, a legal counsel who prepared a preliminary uh, report or a preliminary investigation into those allegations. Now, uh, Archibald's also making some allegations of her own. Uh, what can you tell us about those? Well, as I said, uh, Archibald said she became aware of the allegations against her on February 5th which was a day after the Chiefs of Ontario passed a confidential motion uh, alleging, uh, or pardon me, saying it has reason to believe the AFN Executive Committee has breached its code of conduct uh, and code of ethics. Um, and the contents of that resolution essentially um, call for an independent financial management expert to review policies and procedures for awarding contracts, uh, among other things. Uh, and in her statement, uh, Archibald uh, says or claims that she has documents that show financial improprieties within the AFN. Of course, both the allegations against Archibald have not been substantiated and nor have Archibald's claims of improprieties within the AFN. How will this, as we know, there's uh, an election coming this summer for National Chief, uh, Belgard's not running. How do you see this impacting the race to select a new National Chief? Well, that's interesting, Dennis. Um, I think that's an important question. And of course, uh, this is coming in, in, the, in the next few months and this may um, cool off uh, once the election approaches because of course, as you mentioned, Bellegarde is not running and we have not heard word that Roseanne Archibald is running either. Mm -hmm. However, there are some rumblings among the grassroots that many people would like to see um, a woman as the next national chief. Um, however, uh, we're continuing to to watch and see who is going to run, but ultimately there's going to be a turnover of staff uh, at the AFN whenever a new national chief does assume office. However, that doesn't mean these calls for reform or these calls for independent reviews or change within the AFN are going to go away anytime soon. No, nope, it's going to be an interesting couple of months. Uh, great reporting, Brett. Appreciate you speaking with us about it. Thanks, Dennis.